What's up guys, Stickup Shiro and welcome back to another video and hope you guys are having a great day today because Apple has just dropped iOS 11 beta 8 to the registered developers. Now, this update weighs only 50 megabytes on my iPhone 6s and compared to the previous one, this one is two times smaller than the previous one. So I guess there's not many changes and features in this one. But either way, let's go ahead and get started guys and let's take a look at all of the new features and changes in this beta. And okay guys, so the first thing that I want to say is that the iOS 11 beta 8 is now available on apps for the iPhone.net as always so in this web app you can go ahead and install this one right now on your device and also if you're interested in the links for the IPSWs you can also grab them from appledigger.com my new blog in the latest post from here so this will be available for every single device that you have okay so there's only one change that is in the setup process in this beta which is about Siri so now the Siri card just looks a little bit better there's more details about the Siri and all that stuff so not many changes found in this beta but anyways overall I can tell that the iOS 11 beta 8 is probably the GM version so yeah I can suppose that this is a GM version because iOS 11 beta 7 was already pretty stable and I have read a ton of comments people saying that the iOS 11 beta 7 actually fixed the battery issue and uh, comparing this one to the beta 6 it's a whole new level so I hope that iOS 11 beta 8 will bring even better battery life to the iPhone and yeah the snappiness is is now present in this latest beta of course it's pretty fast and at this point i can say that it's pretty usable and of course you can go ahead and install this one right now on your device even i think on the primary one because you know there is nothing to wait for uh probably not many changes are going to be coming in the future so it's probably like the latest ios 11 beta that we're gonna see so yeah well apple can still release the ios 11 beta 9 in the upcoming week we're still waiting for the uh, september 12th because this is exactly the date when the iPhone 8 is going to be released and alongside that the iOS 11 the, ver the latest version is going to be released with it so we're still expecting that to happen on September 12th so yeah I think guys this should be pretty much it for today of course not many changes in here probably none so I hope you guys anyways enjoyed the video and of course if you did and I want to see more coverage on the iOS beta in the future make sure you hit the like button so that will be so so much appreciated like always and as always guys I hope to see you around on my next one and Peace out.